5 Steps to Use Your Phone Less We all use our phones a lot. For everyday tasks, from picking up groceries at the store to finishing our homework on time, phones take up a large part of our day. But often, they aren't doing helpful tasks and are instead an unnecessary distraction from everyday life. Today, we're going to be talking about some steps that will help you use your phone less and engage in real life more. Think before you scroll. One of the best things you can do is also one of the smallest. Stop and think before you pick up your phone. In that small pause, ask yourself if you need your phone for anything or if you're just picking it up to hold something. Carefully evaluate yourself and your needs at that moment and choose to do something else if possible. Get rid of apps. Apps on our phones are usually mindless and fill in a lot of blank spaces during the day. To use your phone less, get rid of them. Not just apps that you don't use, but ones that take up a large majority of your day for no particular reason. Many smartphones today help you analyze and evaluate where you're spending your time on your phone, and you can use this data to delete or silence apps that take away your valuable time. Silence notifications. For many, the satisfying buzz, bing, or vibration of a new notification can make them open their phone and spiral down into hours of mindless scrolling. Instead, Shut off and silence notifications for everything but your phone and your text messages. This way, you'll only be tempted to open your phone when those more important messages come in. Avoiding social media sites is a great way to keep scrolling on your phone for hours on end. Put it away. Keep your phone away from you, literally. Set it to charge in another room. Leave it deliberately behind when going for a walk or give it to a friend for safekeeping when out and about. By not even having it physically in your presence, you'll end up using it a lot less. There's no need to buy a lockbox quite yet. Try a few simple steps first before resorting to something more drastic. Don't use your phone at night. The blue light that's emitted from your phone tends to keep you awake, and when you don't get enough sleep, you often turn to your phone as a way to mindlessly spend time. The cycle can continue until you find yourself on your last nerve. Keeping your phone on the opposite side of the room when you're trying to fall asleep will help you fall asleep faster and stay asleep longer, resulting in a better view of the world the next day. Takeaway There are a few tried and true ways you can be sure to start using your phone less throughout the day. Without the distraction of your smartphone and the added stress and anxiety that can come from it, you'll find yourself better able to interact with the real world throughout your day. Just a few simple steps will have you stopping to smell the flowers instead of stopping to look for a charger. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.